Yeah, Ashley, and we were at the scenes of both of those fires just four miles apart from each other. And the fire chief says despite all the chaos, they were able to respond appropriately and put those fires out. Black billowing smoke in the city tonight at not one but two separate fires. This one starting just around four this afternoon along a stretch of two story homes on Reisterstown Road. It was really crazy. It's blocked off from Haywood Avenue down to Belvedere. Onlookers watching as crews work to put out the fire. Assistant Fire Chief Roman Clark says one firefighter with a minor injury was taken to the hospital. The incident commander requested a second alarm for additional units to come in to assist with the uh, control of this fire. But the job was not done here. Another large fire burned at least three homes along this block of West North Avenue just an hour or so later. Chief Clark says at least one building partially collapsed and another firefighter here hurt. We did have one firefighter that was injured. It appears to be minor. He has been transported at this time. Now investigations are underway looking into what caused both fires. Witnesses just thankful no reports of any more people hurt. I've been in a position where I lost my home to a fire. All of the memories, the childhood photos, you know, there's no replacing something. A busy night for firefighters and West and Northwest Baltimore fighting two fires hours apart. We do have coverage. All of our units are in service today and um, uh, I think we, we, we uh, managed this very well. And Chief Clark says a few of the affected homes from both fires today were vacant. A couple also were occupied, but still fire chief says that at this time there are no further injuries to report. Live tonight, I'm Amy Lou, WBAL TV 11 News.